Signal Hill United and Bethel United squared off in Bacolet for a place in the quarterfinals of the TFA FA Cup. And it was Signal Hill doing the damage early. Henson Charles opening the scoring in the second minute. It was soon 2 0. Charles again with a strike in the sixth minute. It was all Signal Hill in the first half. Dominic Roberts making it 3 0 in the 28th. Signal Hill has been the better of the two. Bethel did have some looks before the halftime break. Selwyn Campbell with their best chance here. But his team effort is handled by the goalkeeper as Signal Hill went in with a hefty lead at the interval. Bethel looked a better outfit in the second half, stringing some good combinations together, which troubled their opponents. So much so, they earned a penalty in the first minute of the period. Cleon Melville stepped up and got Bethel on the score sheet as he tucks it neatly past the keeper to make it 3-1. Signal Hill was hoping for a penalty of their own in the 65th minute, but the referee was having none of it. Bethel then denied themselves and were almost caught out on the counter attack as the action heated up. It was a good idea in the corner. Oh, this could be dangerous. This could be dangerous. Is it going to be? Signal Hill continued to work hard to increase the lead and got the penalty they were looking for in the 80th minute when Ansel Campbell was stopped illegally by the goalkeeper. Miguel George calmly makes it 4-1 from the penalty mark. Signal Hill United advancing to Thursday's quarterfinal with a big win over Bethel United. We in Cunningham, TTT Sport.